Rosario Ross Genji, born November 10, 1939, is a New York City mobster and captain in the Genovese crime family who became involved in labor, racketeering, and white collar crime. Biography His father, uncles, and cousins were associated with the Bonanno and Genovese crime families. His uncle Angelo Prezzanzano was a capo in the Bonanno crime family and his cousin Frank Gangji Jr. and uncle Frank Gangji Sr. were both drug dealers. In August 1960, Rosario's paternal uncle Frank Sr. was murdered in a mob-related incident that involved Sicilian hitmen being brought down from Montreal, Canada to kill Frank to Umanaro and Gangji Sr. It was suspected the murders were carried out by Genovese mobster Charles Galliadotto who in August 1969 was found strangled to death, supposedly by members of Tumanero's family. Fish Tycoon As a Genovese family associate, Gangji began working at the Fulton Fish Market in Lower Manhattan. Genovese mobster Carmine Olmano controlled the $1 billion per year seafood industry at the market. On August 13, 1981, Gangji was indicted on federal racketeering charges involving the fish market and Local 359 of the United Seafood Workers Union, which represented the market's unionized fish handlers. In the early 1990s, Gangji became a Cooper regime in the Genovese family and ran the fish rackets with Brooklyn Captain Alphonse, Ali Shades, Mail and Gone. During the mid-1990s, Gangai's son Thomas Gangji came under fire as an officer of preferred quality seafood, a seafood wholesaler. The company was later evicted from the fish market due to its non-compliance with the probe on mob control of the market. During the mid-1990s, Gangji discovered a large-scale surveillance campaign by the Federal Bureau of Investigation and New York Police Department, NYPD, against the Genovese family. Since boss Vincent Giganti had gone to prison the last time, the family had assumed a lower key public image and become more security conscious to prevent its high level members from serving long prison terms. Criminal Schemes On November 25, 1997, Genji, his top soldier Ernest Monsvecchi, and Bonanno crime family Captain Frank Lino were indicted in a massive stock fraud and manipulation indictment. The scheme was a classic, pump-and-dump stock scam. The mobsters acquired a large position in the stock of Health Tech International Incorporated, a Mesa, Arizona, health and fitness firm that was traded on the Nasdaq Stock Exchange. Tens of thousands of shares were given to the mobsters by top health tech officials Gordon Hall and Joe Kirkham. The crime families then bribed and threatened brokers at the Wall Street firm of Myers Pollock Robbins Incorporated to sell the stock to unsuspecting investors. Once the stock price reached an inflated level, the mobsters sold their shares and made huge profits, leaving individual investors with worthless stock. The indictment also alleged that the mobsters conspired to defraud the Staten Island Savings Bank in Staten Island, New York, and Sun Records, a famous recording label in Memphis, Tennessee. On February 17, 1998, Ganji, Genovese associate John Albert, and Gambino crime family soldier Vincent DiModico were indicted for extorting contractors and scheming to defraud the Port Authority of New York and New Jersey, which operates Newark International Airport. Ganji received kickbacks, disguised as consulting fees, from companies constructing the $350 million monorail network at the airport. On July 27, 1998, Ganji, Albert and DiModico, were convicted on the Newark airport charges. On January 21, 1999, Gangji pleaded guilty to his involvement in the health tech case and was sentenced to a 97-month prison term. On December 5, 2001, Gangji and Genovese captains Pasquale Parello and Joseph Dent, Jr. were charged with extortion, robbery conspiracy, gun trafficking, loan sharking, labor racketeering and embezzlement, credit card fraud, trafficking in untaxed liquor and cigarettes, gambling and counterfeiting. The indictment was the result of the undercover work of an NYPD officer who operated under the moniker, Big Frankie. This undercover officer, who was actually being considered for family membership, 
would often eat lunch with Perello. On April 30, 2002, Gangji pleaded guilty to racketeering in the 2001 charges and was sentenced to 78 months in prison. Gang I was imprisoned at the Federal Correctional Institution, Skiko in Minersville, Pennsylvania. He was released on August 8, 2008. See also Carmine Romano Joseph Lanz Alphonse, Ali Shades, Mail and Gone. Further reading Capesi, Jerry. The Complete Idiot's Guide to the Mafia. Indianapolis. Alpha Books, 2002. ISBN 0-02-864225-2 Jacobs, James B., Colleen Friel and Robert Raddick. Gotham Unbound. How New York City was liberated from the grip of organized crime. New York. NYU Press, 2001. ISBN 0-8147-4247-5 Rob Selwyn Five Families The Rise, Decline, and Resurgence of America's Most Powerful Mafia Empires New York St. Martin Press, 2005 ISBN 0-312-30094-8 References